you guys at the White House had some very hard headlines this week about inflation and about baby formula. If there's nothing new that you can point to in this speech tonight, did you just schedule it to get people talking about something else? People have died. People have died uh, in the past couple of weeks in particular. Uh, we had 19 kids die in Uvalde. We had, uh, we had people doing everyday things on a Saturday, like some of us do, go to the grocery store, and 10 of them were murdered. Uh, just last night in Tulsa, we're, le we're learning of people who were, uh, again, killed. So this is not about politics. This is not about partisan politics here. This is something that he has worked on uh, since he was a senator. This is very important and real for the president and for the grieving families that he has met with, uh, sadly, in the last two weeks. So this is an opportunity, again, to call for action, uh, to get Congress to move. And, uh, you know, it is, um, it is disheartening to hear that this could potentially, or if I'm hearing this right, uh, could be used as a political tool, and that's not what this is. This is not about person. These are, this is about people's lives. Okay, you got Chicago, for yep. example. They already have plenty of very strict gun laws, some of the strictest in the country. 47 people shot there over the Memorial Day weekend. Nine of them died. So which law would have prevented any of that? All right, well. Do, do we think that all these people in Chicago who are shooting each other are legally buying their guns? So here's, here, here's a couple of examples for you. I was just talking about the red flags law. Um, there are some examples here of how they've prevented tragedies. In California, a study showed that a California red flag law has assisted in the prevention of 21 mass shootings between 2016 and 2018. Uh, Florida, since passing a red flag law in 2018, there have been notable cases of few of, of the law intervening in multiple cases of potential violence. Uh, of potential violence uh, in C Connecticut and Indiana, for for every 10 to 20 preventions under the red flag laws, there was one fewer death than than would otherwise have been expected. So when it enacted, it does help. There are things that we can do, and one of the things that the 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 president talks about with expanding uh, expanding the background checks, if we're able to do that, we are going to take uh, more guns out of the hands of criminals. And that is incredibly important. So there are things here uh, that can be worked out, that can be done, that is not going to prevent every tragedy, but will take us to a better place so we can protect our, our families. Okay,